Hi, I'm Pooja Kamal and I'm going to answer some fun travel questions for Times of India. The best trip that I've had, the best holiday that I've had, the best travel experience. Uh, well, on the top of my mind, it's uh, Australia. We've gone with my family. We experienced Sydney, Melbourne, Brisbane, Gold Coast. Three generations and you can only imagine how action-packed that trip was. And it was beautiful. It was summer here in India, so it was a little nippy there. And we just, uh, I think, experienced the best of Australia. Uh, the one adventure sport that I'm very scared of, well, I'm petrified of heights and they say never say never, but you're never going to see me bungee jump. The one adventure sport that I enjoyed was uh, the flying fish in Bali. Uh, it takes off just a little bit and it's attached to a speedboat, so you get the whole experience of uh, being up and being a little bumpy, but that's just as far as I can go with uh, anything that is uh, scary in terms of adventure. My husband plans my trips, he is amazing when it comes to travel, planning everything to the T, making sure our stay is comfortable and everything uh, over and above that is super action packed and um, I'm not very good with planning trips so I totally leave that part to him. In fact, I always ask him just tell me the dates that we need to travel and do I need to pack for summer or winter and then that's it. I sit in the aircraft and I ask him okay now what's the plan. So uh, I love that and it's always full of surprises. Uh, the one diet rule when I travel, you know, I am a very big foodie. I live to eat, I travel to eat. So the one thing I would not do on a trip is diet, but uh, the only thing I stay away from is alcohol because I can get away with the cheat meals, I can get away with the binge eating, but I don't know how to get away with the water retention that the slightest of alcohol gives, at least me and my body, and that's something that I've realized. Not diet at all, but the one thing I do to stay fit and to be able to burn all the excess calories that I'm putting is I love seeing sunrise and I love seeing sunrise in every country. So I get up early morning before the day's plans and I walk, walk, walk and I see sunrise and I'm hoping it looks after the excess calories on the trip. Mountains or uh, beaches for me, it would be mountains. I'm not a very sun, sand and sea sort of person. so. It would have to be mountain. No trip goes wrong, right? No, no place uh, is uh, wrong or no place is not beautiful. But the only one trip that went a little wrong for me was uh, London. When we went, it was the first time we were traveling with our daughter. She was seven months and she got, uh, she felt really sick. She got a terrible tummy over there. And London had so much to offer and there's so little I could do with her not being in her element. So that was probably the only trip I've come back from saying that I didn't enjoy this one and I wish I hadn't gone. But it also uh, left me wanting to explore London again and in a better way, which I'm sure will happen. A lot more travel will happen once the situation gets better and things open up. So happy traveling, guys.